good morning dear children children today we shall talk about the historical struggles that is known as the french revolutions it is the first chapters from history and today we will talk in details what is called french revolutions and why the french revolutions was started in european country and what was the immediate immediate causes that led to have the french revolutions so dear children first we shall learn here what is called french revolutions so here basically french revolutions means here we need to learn that it is a historical struggle it is a struggles of the peoples to establish the democratic systems in the society so dear children here basically the french revolutions is connected with the political as well as the constitutional changes so here when we talk about french revolutions it means that it is referring to the political changes as well as the constitutional changes which came into being with the happening of french revolutions so here what is basically the people are doing here the people are trying to destroy the despotic power the the powers of the monarchy and they want to establish the powers among the citizens and people are further saying that they do not want to have the monarchy systems in the society because during the time of monarchy there was lot of crisis and during the time of monarchy the monarchy was having continuous war in order to extend the geographical area in order to have the expansion the there was a continuous war and due to this continuous war the financial conditions of france was very very painful so here all the citizens of this french society they are continuously demanding that they are no longer going to have the powers of the monarchy rather than they want to be the ruler of the society by themselves so here with the french revolutions dear children here the people are demanding that hence for the peoples will decide the future of the society hence for the peoples will become the uh, <coughs> the ruler of the society they will save the nations they will decide what is to be happen in the society all these things will be decided by the peoples of french society so that is the reason people are continuously fighting against the ruler and they want to establish the democratic society they want to develop a new type of government where there will be political equality economic equality there will be democratic structures in the society so dear children here we will try to learn what was the causes that led to have the french revolutions so on morning 14 july 17 99 in the city of paris there was an alarm and what the king did here the king is commanding his soldiers to go into the city to control the peoples why the king is sending all his commander here all his troops here because the people are marching towards the king and ruler so here the peoples they are fed up with the systems of the monarchy that is why they want to change the political systems they want to change the constitutional systems and they want to have a new type of governance in the society and for that there is a huge gathering of men and women in the city of paris so to control the situations the king is sending all his troops to move into the cities and there was a rumor that king will set fire on the peoples so dear children here what the people are doing here there was nearly 7000 men and women they are going towards the towns and cities fighting against the rulers and after that we see we understand that they are moving towards the bastilles and here the bastilles is known as the jail so here bastilles it is known as the jail where the king used to keep all his ammunitions 
and it is standing for the power of the despotic ruler. So here, that is the reasons the people they do not like the Bastille jail because here the prisoners are kept, the ammunition are kept, and the Bastille jails it is representing the power of the ruler. So dear children, here when as soon as they going, they are going towards the Bastille. So what they are doing here? They are killing the jailer. They are killing the jailer. They are releasing the prisoners. And at the same time, they are demolishing all these fortress which was there in Bastilles, which was there in the cities of Paris. They are they are destroying it, and they are selling all these fragments in the market to keep it as a souvenir, to keep it as a memory in the society. So this is how we see we understand that people are going towards the. king fighting against the ruler why they are fighting against the rulers because there was a so dear children why the people are fighting against the rulers here what was the reasons so we see we understand that during the monarchy time the ruler was giving more important to its expansion so here the ruler has forgot the concern of the peoples so mostly dear children we see we understand that the primary duties of the ruler as well as the government is to do the welfare work of the peoples so here the ruler has forgot the peoples now the ruler is giving more importance to its palace giving more importance to its newly married queen and the ruler has forgot the peoples the ruler is not giving importance to the concern of the society because during that time due to the continuous war there was a great financial crisis that was seen in france so due to this continuous war that created a financial situations very very painful and it was seen that the continuous war had created the financial crisis in france society so dear children why the people are fighting here here the people are fighting against the rulers because of increasing the high price of bread naturally during the war time when the war will happen the price rate will increase why because the government will take the taxes here so here due to increasing of the high prices of bread the people are fighting against the rulers they do not want to have the monarchy systems they they are not only fighting against the high price of bread but there are lot of lot of Uh, immediate causes as well as lot of reasons and because of those reasons the people are fighting there might be uh, the increasing of financial crisis the increasing of price rate because the ruler has forgot the people and because the people are paying taxes to the government due to all these reasons they do not want to have the monarchy systems and that is the reasons people are fighting against the ruler here So dear children in next classes we will learn how this Louis 16 who came into power and what was the causes of french revolutions and basically why so these these are some of the general reasons and because of these general reasons people they came against the ruler but basically what was the main reasons in which people started the french revolutions those topics we shall be learning in next classes thank you so much for listening to me